Welcome to another edition of Reckless Eating Shorts, aka We Shorts. Matt Zion along with Chris Reckless. You can follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Matt Zion We, and you'll just find him. I'm right here. Yeah. <laughs> when more hairs are hers. Hers. This is classic American hot dog potato chips. Uh, you know, I've, I think we've tried a hot dog flavor. We did. We tried their, uh, it was like hot dog D A U G. Yeah. So it's, I guess this is a different brand because it's a different title. You know, I'm, I, this company so far has not disappointed me. I'm actually have high expectations for this. Oh, yeah. I, hope so too. I didn't try those last time either. So this is a new. The chips are kind of weird. I'm not, a big, I'm not a big fan of the Ruffles type looking chips. I'm not a big fan. It smells good. It doesn't smell meaty. I think it's gonna be more like a ketchup chip. Yeah. All right, let's, let's do it. Yeah, that's pretty good. Mm -hmm. It tastes like a ketchup -y seasoned chip. It tastes like a hot dog that was grilled over a barbecue. Yeah, but the meat, like the artificial meat mm -hmm. flavor isn't in there. I hate things that, that taste like they're supposed to be a meat product. Yeah, that's great. That's really good. This would be perfect with a dip. Why are you looking at all of you? M S G. No. <laughs> Your favorite, have some more. Nope. Have another one. Pretty good. <laughs> You're not gonna go into an MSG coma off of these though. I'm fine. You'll go into an MSG coma off of cheap Chinese food. That's what kills us. Chris and I, after filming the last time with Chuck, went to a local Chinese place around the corner and like came home and Chris passed out on my couch. I went into my bedroom and passed out on my bed and Chuck like stumbled home. I'm sure he went home and went to bed. Like yeah. MSG us up. Yep. I don't know how so many people eat cheap Chinese food because like you just literally pass out. Uh, yeah, MSG is not good in large quantities. Not mm -hmm. at all. Chinese food uses extreme quantities. Unless like, uh, no, um, Panda. I think Panda on the side says no MSG. Actually, no, they use MSG in their fried rice. Well, no, but if you walk by though on the side of the building, at least the one by us, there's a big sticker that says no MSG. Yeah, some places won't put MSG, but some mm -hmm. places use MSG to enhance the flavor. Yeah, well, I mean, I assume if they said no MSG, though, that means no MSG. Yeah. At least in their their uh, chicken, the orange chicken, because yeah. that's the biggest offender of MSG. Oh, yeah. My God. Uh, going back to the topic of hers, classic American hot dog. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I give this a four out of five. It's actually not too bad at all. I um, The hot dog's not overpowering in this. It, give, it gives that hint of the taste like it was grilled. You can taste the ketchup and everything else with what a hot dog has. I'm not a big fan of Ruffles type chips, but this chip's actually pretty good. The texture is amazing, better than Ruffles. So hers like, always gets it right. Yeah, I wish, they're a great company. I, I wish company. I wish they had them in like local markets too, not just Big Lots. Like I wish they expanded all over the place because I want to see more flavors. We have to wait until Big Lots gets them pretty much. Oh, are you getting tired already? I'm okay. Oh, did I cut you off? Is that what you're mad about? What are you no, mad about all of a I'm, sudden? I'm not mad, I'm just getting tired. Oh, what? You had like three chips. Really tired. Oh my god, you're such a bitch. All right, thank you for joining us for this edition of We Short, and we'll see you next time.